Hi there, I'm Anna Demchuk with the Calgary Stroke Program. I'm here to talk to you about our Calgary Stroke Fellowship Program that has been in existence since 2001 in this beautiful uh, city of Calgary. Over 20 countries have been represented within our program. Our philosophy is to train stroke champions around the globe. We uh, have now trained over 90, in fact, in that time frame. They come for usually one to two years, and we accept somewhere between five and eight fellows per year. The program's so special because we've got this sort of unique team culture where we have a lot of debate, thorough debate in things, and have fun doing it at the same time. And the fellows get sort of really indoctrinated into that culture of questioning and challenging uh, every dogma. Uh, we have a number of educational events on a weekly basis uh, where faculty are quite active and participating with the fellows. We've also got a busy service clinic and call volume for lots of uh, training experiences and opportunities. A significant strength of the program is the diversity of fellows that we have. At any given time, you may have fellows from India, China, from Europe, from Australia. This diversity brings a lot of strength to the program. People come uh, with a diverse educational backgrounds. They get to share their experiences. A major strength of a program is clinical trials methodology. Our fellows get to interact with faculty who have diverse experiences in acute stroke trials, in uh, stroke trials, in the rehab space, in prevention trials, and even now, you know, uh, with trials that are focused on vascular cognitive impairment. That diversity helps them. In addition, you know, a clinical trials management is not just about statistics and methodology, it's about the planning that goes into these trials, it's about execution, it's about management. Often in my interactions with fellows, a key thing that they feel is a strength of the program is this experience that they get participating in the design, execution and implementation of clinical trials in places where there's a medical school and an academic milieu embedded within a hospital system, you get higher quality care. In that context, the teaching part of it, whether you're teaching students or residents and fellows, are critical to improving the overall care because if you're teaching it, you gotta do it. One of the things that we're extremely proud of uh, with the program over the years is, is really the, the referral back that we get from many of our diaspora. Uh, we have, uh, having trained over 90 fellows in 20 countries, many of which will often refer back to us some terrific applicants. There's no better way to understand a program and what it's truly all about than to hear from our former fellows. Even though I came from a background where in the residency program we had a lot of exposure to stroke, uh, stroke cases, I have to say that there was loads to learn and one thing that really struck me uh, is how the attendings and the staff and everyone was uh, just so available and present there with you to give you the teaching and uh, just really ask you questions to make sure that you really understood the cases that you were going through. The city was great for families as well. We lived in a very residential safe area. There's lots of parks and activities for the kids and on numerous weekends when you're not on call it's easy to go out to the mountains or skiing or hiking so it, it was a full experience. Yeah. So I think what I got the most from Calgary was the collegial aspect. So it was the first time that I'd ever worked with a team of stroke neurologists, uh, very cohesive, everyone with their own ideas, their own personalities. Um, and Thursday rounds were kind of a, a model for me, which I still try to emulate uh, at our rounds, where there's robust but collegial discussion about cases um, and a true, I think, respect between team members. So what, what, one thing that's um, always expected uh, when we go to conferences is that Andrew, Mike and the gang will uh, bring the new fellows and introduce them to all of us uh, at the meeting. There's an instant connection. So a fellow may be only there for one month, maybe there for a year, but their Calgary is kind of the idea. And then where, no matter where we are, you know, it's considered we're Calgary. So they'll immediately connect you and then they basically say, this is so-and-so, um, you guys should chat and then walk away. And then you introduce that person, in my case, the Ottawa situation, in his case, the Montreal situation. Um, if, if this is a sort of a networking for a job, 
absolutely it helps for these new people. If it's networking for projects, you immediately start looking for collaborative opportunities. Um, I have to say that there were a lot of things that I had heard about um, Calgary's drug program. I, of course, knew uh, some of the leaders of the program, uh, but it's not quite the same to go there and experience it on your own. Um, so I have to say that the learning curve was very, very steep at the beginning. Um, I didn't know I felt like I was already a strip neurologist and I, you know, I had done uh, fellowships before. Um, it was it was a lot of fun, I have to say. It was a, a, a really um, fun year for me. Um, if you want to go someplace just to learn how to do this, you go to Calgary because you just see um, enough cases and uh, the pathology is amazing. But then um, the, the second important thing, of course, is that the, the uh, uh, opportunities to do research, uh, to publish, is tremendous. And, and then the last part is that the relationships you form, um, the connections that you make, will carry you forward uh, for the years to come. This was a wonderful experience of learning, learning of acute stroke, research, and even mentoring from great people like Dr. Uh, Andrew Demchik. And those 18 months made me more confident in managing stroke patients. And I could, following on that, I could go back and, in fact, start a comprehensive stroke care program at our institute, which is one of the biggest comprehensive stroke care program currently in Kerala. One of my favorite things in the Calgary Stroke Program is our weekly stroke case rounds on Thursday mornings at 7.30. It's a terrific opportunity for us to get together and debate stroke management uh, and some of the difficult decision-making that we have. Stroke case rounds is really a, a multidisciplinary effort where we get great uh, participation from all of our uh, stroke neurology faculty, uh, our nurse practitioner, our neuroradiologists, including uh, our interventionalists, our neurosurgeon, vascular neurosurgeons, our, our stroke fellows attend, many of the neurology residents, our trainees, and, and then of course our visitors also. Uh, this is a perfect opportunity for them to, to where we can showcase our program and how we interact. With it. Um, we really like and encourage active participation from everyone. Uh, that's where you can get uh, uh, the best thinking, the best debate, uh, and learn uh, and perhaps identify uh, uh, areas where we can improve on our management and, and care through research. We identify a problem, but we can then test that problem based on some of our case experiences that come from these stroke case rounds. I was flipping through the BMJ one day and there was an advert for a stroke fellowship in Calgary. I happened to have been skiing here the year previously and so I kind of knew that if stroke didn't work out that the skiing was going to be good. And so I came for two years, 17 years ago. And, uh, and I guess I like to see the rest as history.